Be the first to finish this bowl of cold sesame noodles, and you're the new world champion. Ba 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 ba. This is going to be a good one. I am in West Reading, PA, at their Fall Fest at a place called Noodle. They are hosting the World Championship for Cold Sesame Noodle Eating. There's two categories, a men's and a women's, and I got here just in time for the women's championship. We are off. And to be honest with you, for being a world championship, I was surprised there's only four women in this event. Now, this event was advertised online, was even on a billboard on a major highway in the area. But four women actually came to the contest. Uh, they have two sides of this restaurant. You can't tell from here, but uh, if there's more eaters like the men's, we're going to have to go down the side. But these women are trying to become world champions. I use that term loosely. Apparently, in the eating world, if you just have an eating contest, you can call it a world championship. So we're going to call this the world championships. Now, this is literally open to anyone who wanted to come. So whatever eater in the world wanted to come here, it, they could have. Uh, and this is the four we've got. It looks like we have four eaters that probably haven't been in too many eating contests. I'm going to go so as far as they've never been in one before. But what a way to start right at the world championships. They're tearing through this. Now, it's only a, a one bowl contest. So it's one pound of sesame noodles. First one done wins. Sorry about the camera shaking there. I got caught up in the moment. I remember the, my first world championship I ever won. And, and I'm looking at these women here. One of them is going to be the next world champion. It's just an exciting experience for them. <laughs> now, who's going to be the second best in the entire world? All four of the female contestants seem to be having a great time, so big thanks to them and a special thanks for the top two. Congratulations. I found it really hard to compete in this world championship and get good quality footage of what the food looked like, but this is one pound of cold sesame noodles, the best angles that I got, including Eric modeling it for me. He's going to use chopsticks. I went with a fork. We'll see which one's better. I think because it's a world championship event, each of the competitors really wanted to go over the rules very, very well. Uh, are we allowed to touch the food first? Are we allowed to pick up the bowl beforehand? Are we allowed to mix the noodles up beforehand? Uh, can we pour water on top of the noodles, to maybe make it quicker? So there's a lot of rule discussion going on. And there's also a rule that if you eat messy, they will give you a yellow card warning the first time. The second time you get a yellow card, you're disqualified from the contest. So everyone wanted to make sure they were doing the rules right to a T. I want to try to limit the voiceovers during the contest because the men's contest went a little bit quicker than the women's. I spilled a little bit there at the end, but I was able to clean it up. Let's see who gets second. 
and then third. Big round of applause for all of our contestants. In third place, we have Tyler. And that's a wrap. A big thank you to all the great competitors in this world championship event and to Noodle for hosting the contest. It could have been anywhere in the world, but lucky enough, it was within a half hour of my house. Thanks for coming to another video, and I'll see you guys again soon. Don't forget to check me out on Facebook at Real Notorious B.O.B. There are different, shorter edits of all my videos.